In this video, we're going to learn about a new beta feature that uses AI to generate textures for your meshes. First things first, you'll need to flip the beta flag to try it out. You can do this by going to File, Beta Features, and searching for AI Texture Generator. Open the Texture Generator by selecting it under the Model tab, and select the mesh you want to texture by selecting it in the viewport. In the Texture Generator window, at the top you'll see the generation angle. This tells the AI what feature of your model is the most important. In this example, I'm going to say that the front of the tower is the most important feature I want the AI to emphasize the most. Right below the generation angle is the prompt input window. This is where you describe what texture you want for your mesh. I'm going to tell it I want it to look like an old stone tower and click Preview. If you like what you see in the preview window, click Save and Apply for the texture to be saved as a surface appearance and applied to your mesh. The advanced options can help you fine tune your results. Randomizing the seed increases the different types of results you can get with the same prompt. Keep the seed constant to generate the same preview for a specific prompt. The Generation Angle Coordinate fields lets you be really specific with your generation angle by letting you use the precise coordinates of your mesh. Smart UV Unwrap intelligently decides whether or not to regenerate a UV map for your mesh. If your mesh has compatible UVs, it'll leave your mesh as is. But if they're not, the texture generator will automatically rebuild them to ensure a higher quality generation. If you don't want your UVs to be changed, just deselect this option. If you want to know how compatible UVs are defined, there's resources in the description that'll go into more detail. Lastly, selecting Specify Front View tells the AI if your generation angle is the front of your mesh. Selecting this helps improve the results for objects with a clear front and back, like avatars. If you want to fine-tune your results more and notice any imperfections in the generated texture, you can easily export the generated texture to take it over the finish line in third-party software like Photoshop or Substance Painter. To do this, select the mesh you textured in the Explorer. Right-click and select Export Selection. After giving it a name and choosing where you want to export it, you'll find your mesh as an OBJ file with the AI-generated texture as a PNG that you can then open in a software of your choosing. Thanks for watching! We hope you found that helpful. For more information on the AI Texture Generator, be sure to check out the resources in the description.